Hi kids. It's a bright sunny day and the summer holidays are over. It's time for Chikku to go back to school. Hello children. Welcome back to school. Today we are going to learn how to read a clock. Children, this is a clock. It has numbers from 1 to 12. It has 3 hands. The second hand the minutes hand and the hours hand let's know what seconds minutes and hours mean snap your fingers the time taken to snap your fingers is 1 second 60 such seconds make 1 minute 60 minutes make 1 hour and 24 hours make 1 day now let us learn how to read these seconds minutes and hours in a clock we will begin with seconds hand Whenever we read seconds on a clock each number on the clock is interpreted as a multiple of 5 1 is interpreted as 5 2 is interpreted as 10 likewise 3 as 15 4 as 20 5 as 25 6 as 30 7 as 35 8 as 40 9 as 45 10 as 50 11 as 55 and 12 as 60 when the seconds hand reaches 60 the minutes hand will move by 1 indicating that 60 seconds make 1 minute Task time. What's the time now? It is fifteen seconds. Yes, it is fifteen seconds. What's the time now? It is thirty-five seconds. Yes, it is thirty-five seconds. What's the time now? It is fifty seconds. Yes, it is fifty seconds. Now, let's move on to the minutes hand. The minutes hand is similar to the seconds hand. Each number on the clock is interpreted as multiple of five. 1 is interpreted as 5 2 is interpreted as 10 likewise 3 as 15 4 as 20 5 as 25 6 as 30 7 as 35 8 as 40 9 as 45 10 as 50 11 has 55 and 12 as 60 when the minutes hand reaches 60 the hours hand will move by 1 indicating that 60 minutes make 1 hour task time what's the time now it is 15 minutes yes it is 15 minutes What's the time now? 
It is 35 minutes. Yes, it is 35 minutes. What's the time now? It is 50 minutes. Yes, it is 50 minutes. Lastly, we have the horse hand. It represents the numbers on the clock as they are. 1 as 1, 2 as 2, 3 as 3, till 12 as 12. When the horse hand moves from 12 to 12 twice, it makes 24 hours and hence a day. So, 12 multiplied by 2 is equal to 24 hours which in turn is equal to 1 day. Task time What's the time now? It is 3 o'clock. Yes, it is 3 o'clock. What's the time now? It is 7 o'clock. Yes, it is 7 o'clock. What's the time now? It is 10 o'clock. Yes, it is 10 o'clock. Now, let us put all the three hands together and read the time. What's the time now? It is 2 o'clock, 25 minutes and 30 seconds. Yes, it is 2 o'clock, 25 minutes, 30 seconds. What's the time now? It is 5 o'clock, 5 minutes and 40 seconds. Yes, it is 5 o'clock, 5 minutes, 40 seconds. What's the time now? It is 9 o'clock. 25 minutes and 55 seconds. Yes, it is 9 o'clock, 25 minutes, 55 seconds. As we have seen earlier, the clock runs from 12 to 12, twice a day. In order to differentiate between two similar times, we have an interesting concept. A day has five different parts. Midnight, morning, noon, evening, and night. We have two parameters called as antimeridium and postmeridium. Antimeridium is abbreviated as AM and postmeridium is abbreviated as PM. AM starts from 12 at midnight and goes up to 12 in the noon. PM starts from 12 in the noon and goes up to 12 in the midnight. So, once you finish reading a clock, look outside the window and see which part of the day you are at. Now tell me, what's the time? It is 5 o'clock. 
5 minutes and 40 seconds. It is PM. Yes, it is 5 o'clock, 5 minutes, 40 seconds. Okay children, now go home and tell your parents what you learned today. Have a good evening. Bye bye. Parents, today your kid and Chiku have learned how to watch time. To let them learn more together, please subscribe to Whitecraft Kids channel. Good day. Bye bye.